How are RNA molecules involved in the development of cancer? Let's take a look behind the science. We're here in the lab of Dr. Florian Kareth, and we're going to talk to him about his exciting work with RNA and melanoma metastases. Let's start from the basics. What is RNA and what does it have to do with cancer? Okay. So, well, RNA is an important molecule in the cells. We have about 20 to 25,000 genes, that's DNA, of course. And each of these genes can make uh, a molecule called messenger RNA, which carries information and the cell uses these messenger RNAs to then produce proteins. I see. So DNA goes to messenger RNA, goes to protein, and cancer cells produce messenger RNAs that lead to proteins that can cause the cancer. But your research is looking at can the messenger RNAs directly lead to cancer? Yes, that's absolutely right. And uh, that's precisely what we found. Uh, there's actually an, a number of messenger RNAs that we believe can uh, contribute to cancer development. We specifically looked at melanoma development. I see. So it's really a balance that has to happen. And in normal cells, there's a balance. But in cancer cells, uh, there, the balance has been perturbed. So Florian, what can we do about this for our cancer patients? Well, that's an excellent question. So we are still very early on, of course. Uh, there's a lot of research that we need to do. But we think that there's very cool RNA technologies out there that we could use to go in within the melanoma cells and somehow destroy these messenger RNAs that uh, disrupt this, this network and then promote the production of these pro-metastatic proteins. Uh, but we are very hopeful that we can use this approach to um, at least reduce and maybe even prevent uh, melanoma metastasis. So if we can manipulate the RNA, we can help prevent the cancer from that spreading. Is, that is our hope and that's what we're looking into in, in future research, yes.